Hello and welcome to Oz Toy Reviews. Now, hello parents and toy collectors, it's your good pal Oz, and today we're going to be reviewing um, some vinyl Ushi. So, we got a few, I was going to say, we got lots of DC ones at the top there, we got two Toy Story ones down there, and then depending on how much time we got left, we'll open up some uh, Ushi's mystery capsules. I'm kind of hoping for DC because, like, I'll, I'll probably do a little bit more DC than Marvel today because I realized I don't even have Superman. I don't even have that armored Batman. There's like so many I still don't have. So I'll probably focus more on DC today. Uh, but we'll, we'll do some Marvel as well just to mix it up. Um, now that's that's really all I have to tell you. So let's get straight into it. So st first up, we'll check out uh, Superman. Take off this, and then take out that. Now, I've not really reviewed many of these, I, uh, yeah, th I think these are the first, oh no, I did one Toy Story one of uh, Bo Peep, but this is the first of the just normal ones I have ever checked out. And they're really cool, they aren't squishy at all, like Ushis, or, yeah, like they're, they're just solid, they, there's no movement, but that's, that's cool. And yeah, they feel kind of smooth, just like a big chunk of plastic. Oh yeah, we go, we got a bit of movement from the cape there. You can check out his butt. <laughs> and yeah, there's a little bit of movement around. Oh no, looks like like it looks like the way it's been put together is the shoes or a different component to the legs. But there's no movement there. But there we go. I'll get my hands out of the way just so you have a look at them. Now, yeah, very cool. Okay, and we'll put them over here. There we go, big Superman. And we've got the small versions of some of these characters, but not many. Like that's why I'm opening more DC ones because I didn't even have Superman. But uh, next up, we'll do Batman. Now this armored Batman looks pretty awesome. Okay, there we go. Now first, let's give him a quick spin. I love all the belts and different kind of plates of armor he's wearing. The cape, just like Superman, there's a little bit of movement. It's very stiff, but you could probably lift it up if you wanted to check out the detail around the back there. If I lift it up too much, it might I feel it might break or bend in a bad way, so I won't do that. His mask looks very cool. There we go, very nice. There's no hole down the bottom, oh no! Oh, and uh, I just saw the name there, but yeah, these guys were given to me free by Head Start. Um, but yeah, of course, like always, I've said this a billion times now, um, all because these are free, I've got no obligation to um, be good or be nice to them and give them a good review. But fine with Ushis, I generally do. I don't know. If, they, if I had to go back, like if they release another series, like Series 1 or 2 again, I might be a bit critical because there was lots of like problems with the paint and bleeding and the models were often wrong uh, but nowadays they're pretty pretty on pretty good they're pretty like uh, good quality now anyway now here we have Aquaman this hair looks really nice how it flows down like that I like all the detail in the suit there we go look in good okay uh, put you over there okay Buzz Lightyear your turn whoa, 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 whoa. let me know in the comments below if you already have any of these big vinyl figures because they are cool like for putting just on your bookshelf just to display normally she's a kind of small too small for that I don't know you could but not as well as these guys here we go, he's got his backpack on. Oh, and I think we have a Buzz Lightyear. There we go, the small version. Not exactly the same pose, but good enough. Pretty close. There we go, looking nice. And um, I'll quickly, I'll put him in front of him. I forgot to show you, but uh, here's Aquaman too. So the Ushi version of Aquaman and then the big version of Aquaman. The main difference I've noticed is just the coloring. coloring. So. Uh, Got bright green there, dark green there. Everything else seems to be the same. Like the little Ushis are so detailed now that uh, not really much detail is missed out at all. Oh there, there we go, on the gauntlets. You see how he's got like the, that kind of pattern on his gauntlet there? But uh, not, or on his glove, but not there. But anyway, that's cool. And one more, we got Woody to check out. 
and then we'll open up some mini capsules. Okay, so for Woody, there he is by himself. Oh, there's a nice smell that came with Woody. Look at that. Hey, forgive my band-aid too. I um, cut myself about a week ago, really deeply. I was cutting uh, some meat with a knife, and I just as I was cutting, I was thinking, don't cut towards yourself, don't cut towards yourself. But I kind of thought that just as I started cutting, and for some reason, I kept going. <laughs> And then, yeah, a second later, my knife kind of went through the meat uh, quicker than I expected. And before I knew it, it was buried in my finger. So um, that's, that's why I'll probably have a band-aid for a little while. Okay, there we go. Is Woody, and we do have a comparison Woody. Not exactly the same pose, but pretty cool. Pretty close. This one looks like an angry Woody. Look at his eyebrows, far out. But there we have it. Okay, so that's the last of the big vinyl figures. And we'll move all this out the way. Okay, now we'll do some capsules. So, how are we doing? I think we got about four minutes until we're in that kind of prime area where it's about 12 minutes long. So, we'll get, I think we could do maybe two of each. There we go. Okay, now I need my knife. Okay, now I might need more band-aids after this. After this video, if I don't cut this nicely, there we are, okay. Okay, so first one we have today is... Oh. Aha, Red Tornado! Now, I think I've got a few of him now. Maybe, maybe three. He was the very first one I opened of uh, Ushi's XL. So here we go, put him down there. I might lower the camera a little bit. There we go. Okay, now next one. Okay, now I'm hoping for, let's just have a quick look. I can't remember who is the limited edition guy. I think Crystal Blue Superman. Yeah, Crystal Blue Superman, which I have, but I don't have Oh, maybe there isn't just a straight up normal Superman. Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, where are we, where are we looking at? There, that one there. But he's in a different pose to this Superman. I thought there'd be a Superman doing that same kind of cool pose. But no, it looks like a different pose. But anyway, hopefully we'll find him today. Um, but yeah, the, the limited edition guys are Crystal Blue Superman or Golden Armored Batman. Um, so if I can just find that. Oh yeah, there is an Armored Batman. Oh, where are we? <laughs> there is an Armored Batman. So if I get him, then he'll be cool to kind of put with this guy. Anyway, let's go. So that, now that I know what I'm looking for, what I'm aiming for, it makes it a little bit more fun. Okay, we got this time, we got the Flash! Whoa! Give him a spin. He's cool, I don't know if I've got the Flash already. No, I don't think I do. He's pretty cool, okay. We'll put him there, and that we'll put him next to Red Tornado, there we are. Uh, now onto Marvel. I might just swap some around because I think I've seen, I've opened a lot more Marvel guys than I have DC, so I might, I might open up a few more DC ones now. Okay, and who do we have? Ah, open. There we go, we got Black Panther. Now this looks like there is two Black Panthers. I think this is the metallic one, just because he's slightly more grey. Uh, the other Black Panther, the non-metallic one, is just a darker shade of black. So there we go, Black Panther. Now, I'm going to put that one aside. I'll grab... We'll do two more. Two more DC Ushis. Okay. Hey, and let me know in the comments below how your collection's going. Like, if you have a lot, let me know. Um, you can see me photos on Instagram, I've already got a few photos of people's Ushi collection, which is very cool. And, uh, or let me know which one's your favourite as well. I know I've got a favourite few, which I always leave where I can see them during the day. Alright, now what's this uh, Bizarro, so holographic Bizarro. Very cool, spin them around. Cool, okay, holographic Bizarro. I think I've got him before, so I think he's a double up for me. Okay, now very last one. Okay, now this is series one and they've probably been out for about 
four months now, so hopefully a series two is in the making. Probably won't get them by Christmas. I don't know, maybe. Okay, next. Ah, oh, some are harder than others to open, especially when you're one finger down. Ah. Okay, there we go. Okay, well now we have Beast Boy. Now he is awesome. I love Beast Boy. You may have seen in the intro when they all kind of like explode out of the um, like the Oz Toy Review logo. That Beast Boy is one of them. And if you look closely, you'll see him transform, but um, I kind of did it badly where he's transforming as he's moving off the screen and you don't really get to see him in this new transform stage. I think it's like a dinosaur he transforms into. But anyway, there we go, there's Beast Boy. So we got heaps of cool new guys. So let's quickly check them out one last time. So today we got, uh, we'll do the big guys first. So we got Aquaman, Superman, uh, Woody, Buzz Lightyear, and Armored Batman. And then uh, of the small Ushis, we got uh, Beast Boy, Titanium Black Panther, Red Tornado, Flash, and uh, Holographic Bizarro. So um, guys, like always, if you like this video, let me know by clicking the thumbs up like button. There's no room for my thumb. Thumbs up like button. Subscribe if you have not yet already subscribed. Uh, leave a comment down below or on Instagram, wherever you like. Uh, but until next time, guys, have a great week. Take care of yourself, and I will catch you next time.